I didn't even mention Fuki, but I mean, it's Fuki. You don't have to mention her. It's she is who she is. She is fantastic. Salutations, fellow metalheads. Welcome to the channel where the beats never stop and the good vibes keep flowing. And we are back with another reaction today. This time we're continuing our journey through the Dolls apartment with Dolls Box. Um, we've hit almost every song on this album, and today we're picking out another one. And we're looking at the song that I believe translates to Toy Soldiers, which fits the theme of the album. Um, this is one of those bands, Dolls Box, that is just so full of talent. The member of Gotcha Rick Spin, uh, plus Fuki, who is an unbelievable singer. It's really hard not to enjoy them. Um, let's see where they take us here through the apartment and check this one out. Link to the original video in the description below. All right, let's go. I love that they did a video for every song on this album. It's like wind up toy soldiers. All right, the opening to that very, very poppy, uh, which is fine because we know what the overall concept of this album is. And I believe the whole thing is like making fun or not making fun, but poking a little bit at the uh, Japanese idol culture again, which makes this if this. If I translated that right, and it's really called Toy Soldiers, um, it makes sense. Uh, the video is depicting pretty much what I figured it would be. They're all standing, standing firm. Uh, and uh, so, I mean, we're talking about an industry that is, from what I know, and I don't know a lot about it because I'm new to, this in the, to the whole J, uh, idol stuff, but an industry that like pushes people and forms them forms groups into these idol groups and uh they may not have I'm, that's we're not, i'm not gonna say it. they are all from what i've heard anyway of the ones we've come uh talented but it's like mainstream produced music that is produced for fans and for the general public and basically in my opinion to probably to make money uh which obviously should be the opinion uh the goal of all of these bands is you know eventually to make money but the talent that these girls possess they're trying to say that they're not put in they don't want to be soapboxed into that specific group so they come out with this these amazing songs that the videos poke a little bit of fun at it throughout the whole thing while they're producing some amazing music and the talent behind the the production and the music is top notch. I went off on a rant there and rambled some, so I'm going to stop now. Uh, we're going to go back, catch that transition back into the chorus. It reminds me of like 80s pop, late 80s.
Ooh, nice little run by Tomo there. I love the uh, symbolism there. Symbolism of the, the toy dolls that are doing, you know, doll things and being very robotic and everything. Um, and we have five beautiful girls here that are so much more than, you know, just their beauty. They are talented beyond belief. Uh, and they, they prove it every time they go out. And that's what I think they're trying to symbolize here, that they're just more than... They're more than pretty faces. Um, they are, they, they belong in this industry. They, they don't need an idol agency to do it. I mean, what can I say? Tomo just nails the solos. They're never very long, but they're just perfect for what they need to be. Uh, that's what. I, that's one of the things I love about all the members of this band, Got Your Expin, whichever one you want to put them in, um, that none of them try to steal the spotlight. Uh, they're all equally talented. Uh, Koga is one of the you know, best bass players for the style that she plays. Hana is just so multi-talented. Oreo is just a crazy nut, but a, a phenom on those keys. And Tomo is one of the, one of my favorite guitarists. Um, because she never tries to outshine anything. She just does her solo thing and she knows she's good. She doesn't need to prove herself. And then when she does do some of those longer extended solos, it just shines that even more. All right, we're going to check out her solo again. I didn't even mention Fuki, but I mean, it's Fuki. You don't have to mention her. It's she is who she is. She is fantastic. Oh, wow. That was an unexpected ending. That is one of the true to be continued there. Wow, really interesting ending there. Let's talk. It's like the way it ended like that. It's like they wound up the toy soldiers to play the song. And then at the very end, they all just ran out and just ended. That's, that was kind of cool. So I'll be interested to see what the next one is. Uh, I'm pretty sure the next song is Dolls Box uh, by Dolls Box. <laughs> Uh, so, uh, it'll be, uh, it'll be interesting to see when we get to that one. That was a really, uh, very abrupt, very abrupt, but, but I enjoyed it. Uh, I think, again, I think the symbolism is there and I like, that's one of some things I like about watching music videos. I always, I usually, I prefer a live version, but sometimes the music video is where you're going to get the symbolism and you're going to get what they're actually talking about. And that's why I always do these, uh, 
music videos for this particular band. And then we'll go back and check out any live performances at a later time. All right. So if you guys really want to help the channel out, the easiest way to do that is just hit the like button and then share it with your friends. If you did enjoy uh, the video enough, then by all means, go ahead and hit that subscribe button, but only do so if I really earned your subscription. Uh, if you have any suggestions for future reactions, let us know in the comments below. I do read every comment that comes in, so yours will be seen. Don't forget that I also stream on Twitch. Uh, we do uh, live concert streams and gaming over there, so if those are things that you enjoy, by all means, come join us over there. Follow me on Twitch. You won't be disappointed. Discord is a great one-stop shop to find all the information about the channel, past, present, and future. Keep up to date with what's going on and interact with a fantastic community over there that really helps me a lot, and I appreciate them. Um, unlock the full potential of your support with our Buy Me a Coffee page, and this is where you're going to find uh, the ultimate channel experience with all the unedited and unrestricted videos that YouTube may have blocked or removed, or any of those live concert streams that you may have missed when I did them live on Twitch. Um, they're all over there waiting for you. Plus, you have the power to help steer the channel in a direction you want to go simply by making requests and having your voice heard. Um, so don't wait any longer. Come support us on Buy Me A Coffee and let's continue this amazing journey together. Uh, links to all the social media can be found in the description below. Pick the one or the ones that you enjoy and I'll be sure to see you on them. With that, I hope everyone has a great day and I'll catch you all next time.